Alright, so hi again and welcome to Tips Kalimba, where even you can learn how to play. So by the way, my name is Robin and welcome. Okay, so if it's your first time here, do consider subscribing and be part of the family. So what we're going to talk about today is something that has been asked a lot. And this has something to do with your nails. Yes, yes, yes. So the question is... How long should they be? Could you play your kalimbo without nails? Is it necessary to grow them out? And do uh, nail extensions or artificial nails, do they actually work? So stick around because we are going to talk about that right now. So the thing about your nails is that depending on the length of it, sometimes if it's too long, or because of the shape, it can create like a clicking sound, this one. My nail here is shorter, while this is longer, right? But compare them to this one. Some thumbs have nails that are up to here, see? You can see that there is still a space of skin here you see that while other thumbs looks like this the starting of the growth of their nail is very high like it starts already up there see the difference in the space so that's why when people say three millimeter two millimeter it's really not that specific because the two millimeter that you got here is not precisely also the same two millimeter of this kind of nail that you get okay so when we're gonna view your thumb it's from the back okay so like that then the nail up here this is what we are going to measure from the tip of your skin to the most top of your nail. This is how we're gonna measure it. Some have, it's like a square, rounded square. This is a nail. While there are nails that are oval. See? And I noticed that this has a lesser tendency of having some clicks because with this one, sometimes the edges here, your edges here, they hit your tines, especially if your nails are already longer. This is just from experience, okay? This is already good. Like this one is already good. This length already creates clicking sounds when I play. Now, I will make this round and this one is going to be square now let's compare how it sounds like okay but i still hear a little clicking on it so uh, just based on this for me i would go with the rounded shape as compared to your square shape so for that i'll just make them even okay when you try to feel it you can see that there's like a pointy part that's where you need to file more okay so the issue if you don't have your nails is that instead of playing it like this you tend to play it like this right because you're trying to use the short your nail to press it right and just look at the position of my thumb it looks so awkward and this actually makes this part hurts very clicky and for this one I don't know it's like it's since it's thick it makes me want to go like this to summarize it and make it short uh, what is my personal take on it 
um, comparing to your extensions, your gel nails, or your natural nails, I would go for your natural nails because um, their thickness, it doesn't make that sound. And then another point is that when you're gonna look at the length of your nails, don't look at it from the front, but look at it from the back. For me, as long as it is past your this uh, flesh part of your thumb, your that's so good for me. I mean, for me, it works already. And then as you play, you start to hear your. For me, that's already a sign that okay, I need to trim down my nails. After you watch this, try to play your kalimba. See if your playing makes you do the clicking sounds. If you do, then maybe your nails are too long or maybe your shape is too square. That would be all for today. And again, get ready because you are going to receive some blessings of love from me tonight. Okay, so everyone, thank you for being here. And I pray that may the Lord bless you and may He keep you and that the rest of your week, the days, be filled with purpose, inspiration, and aspiration to go beyond what you think you can, all right? Especially with your playing or anything that you're passionate about, okay? So with that being said, let us roll the credits and here are our amazing cutting buddies again, all right? So thank you and I will see you next time. Show.